So today I am trying this game called Greedfall. Let's go ahead and start a new game. Uh, I'll go normal. Hmm, painting. Could you stand a little taller, just a tad? Like this? Yes, yes. Oh, pose him with the skeleton. Lower. Gaze a little more to the right. There, now, hold the pose. Oh. Interesting. What is that? Uh... Alright, so this is the character that I've designed, playing with these options here. Let's keep going. Uh, what should my play style be? Figure so, okay. Warrior, technical, magic. Yeah, I haven't really, I haven't played Greedfall before, so I don't know what my style would be. I think I'm going to go technical, partly because it recommends lock picking. Uh, it just seems like a good set of starting skills, so we'll see where that goes. Next, I got to put in some attributes. Uh, I guess I only get one attribute. Uh, so I'm actually going to go with accuracy, because I feel like firearms is going to be kind of cool to use. Alright, and that's it. Just get the one. Now to choose a talent. Uh, so I'm going to go with intuition for the contextual dialogue options, because I feel like that's one of the few things I can't just go back and do worst case. And with that, let's start the game. Just a few more minutes. You have such an incredibly singular face. That's a compliment, my lord, out of my mouth. <laughs> Ooh, I'm a lord. Your particularity gives you character. You're still here. Yeah. We've nearly finished. Have you any more need of me, master? You haven't forgotten that we're setting sail today, have you? Of course. Where are we going? Setting sail? We're going to Your the new world? Nowhere to be found. I've searched the palace from cellars to attics. Your uncle is beside himself. He was of a mind to paint the town last night. Don't worry, I shall track him down. Make care to your own preparations without wrinkling another frown. We'll meet you on the boat. Uh, it's I just make a rhyme there? Take account of the responsibilities awaiting him. He should go and inform the ambassadors of Telemi and the Bridge Alliance of his departure. Have no fear, Master. I will go and see them in his name. Well, well, there's my first quest. Find the brother. I your pardon, but urgent matters call me away. My Talk to the people. Later. Impossible, my lord. You are leaving with a tide, if what I've been told is correct. I am sorry, sir. Truly, I must be going. Uh, my lord, please, I beg you. Oh. Her highness has personally requested my finish. Thank you, cousin, for getting me out of that. <laughs> oh, cousin, not brother. Ooh. All right, all right. Visible at the top. It indicates where I need to go. Okay, so I need to say goodbye to my mother. I'm gonna just oh, talk to the workers. Day, Ooh. I'm liking this so far. Shift to sprint. Good, good. I don't see an endurance somewhere, but I'm sure there's an endurance hey! system. Green blood. Oh. And so the day has finally come. My royal fledglings are leaving the nest. Such a small the dagger. Loyal and tenacious master of arms. As loyal as your goal. Enough with the cold mercenary. I know you like us. Hmm. Still hiding your men in the unsuspecting shadows of the greats of this world, I see. Hey, our blades are the only thing keeping you dainties alive. <laughs> Kurt, I'm not in need of your protection. I'm no longer and we're gonna fight. Is that so? Yep. Well, let's see. Gotta prove that I can defend myself, right? Attack three times. Attack. Oh, there we go. Main attack. Secondary attack. Ooh, a kick. Defend yourself. 
Uh, okay. Nice. That's not too bad. Alright, so now we just gotta do it. Oh! Uh, okay. Pause the game to let you choose your next action. Skills. Okay. A potion, health potion. There we go. All right, now let's beat him. Okay, hold on, hold on. Oh, all right, so that didn't go so well. Me who thought myself a competent weapons master. It's becoming a little hard to believe. Don't add insult to injury. This is humiliating enough. We'll need to get you through the basics, or you risk getting your feathers plucked at the first sight. Oh, okay, so I didn't do that well. That's what they're saying. In that case, Otto here is going to be your training partner. Go, fight with honor. Okay, so I was kind of supposed to lose that, I think. Hopefully, that'll just make me feel better. Firearms, bind number two, I guess. No, no, I want to shoot. How do I shoot? Oh, nice. Oh, okay, so I guess one count is a miss or something. Armor. The physical armor is shown with shields. Okay. Uh, to break, you can use an impact weapon. Magic attacks ignore armor. Interesting. Break through your opponent's armor. Okay. Zero to set a trap. You could just walk in there. Yeah, like that. Okay, now what? Fury. Uh, segment of media fills up when I do things. The visual. Oh, okay. Okay. I sheath my weapon, and everyone loves me it again. Does. And I'd like to be on my way. I've quite the list of things to do before we depart. Indeed. <laughs> Remember that you can always train in our barracks on the island if you're feeling rusty. Are your bags packed for the great departure? Yes. Great no departure. Idea. Where are we going, though? You're not angry that I'm coming with you, I hope. Uh, no, no. We're happy that it's coming country. along. I'm thrilled that both you and Sir de Cossillion are joining. Why don't? Heart. Why wouldn't we a want them? friends at your side in unknown territory is a boon. Ah, so the old goat is coming too. And there I was thinking I would die of boredom <laughs> on the trip. By the way, where is our future governor hiding? I was hoping to put his skills to the test as well. Oh, so you're going somewhere no new. He had plans to celebrate his departure last night, and we haven't seen him since. You know, Constantine. I should have gone with him, but my heart wasn't in the mood for celebration. The thought of bidding my mother farewell. It is never easy to say goodbye. But you should be going to see her now. So where are she we going that mother we'll can't come? The palace. Then we'll go and find Seems kind of random. Well. Like, we're obviously going to set up a settlement, I think. Uh, but then... We just can't... Mother can't come? Why not, you know? All right, in here. What is this? Oh, maybe that's why. I've asked a thousand times. Oh, it's you, my dear child. Mother, I'm sorry. I'm having trouble getting used to your condition. 
Come now, let's speak of more pleasant things. I'm so very happy to hear your voice. You remind me so much of your father. I do miss him so. Today is the big day, isn't it? Ready to set sail for that yeah. island everyone's talking about. Yes, but the idea of leaving you behind, alone and ill. Dying, my child. Alas, there is nothing you can do by staying that would ease my suffering. One thing brings me to you. Is this related to whatever is going on with his chin? full of miracles, and we might find a cure. Even if I were to find it, I would never be able to return in time to... I know. But it brings me comfort that to know my son has left on a mission to heal his people. Yeah. Come now. It is time for you to take leave. There must be Here. his people, right? Take Maybe that's a related to his weird scarring. What is it? A family heirloom. Something that... Take it and keep it with you. May it bring you good luck. All my blessings. Go yeah, because like we got the swirls under her eyes and stuff. Be off. Maybe it's related. It's kind of sad. All right, so we got this coin. This is not where I left, uh, but here's Kurt. So I guess I gotta do everything else in the area before I do the main event, because I might just get teleported. That's good to know. Yes, hello. Who are you? Kurt. It's done. Sorry, this Kurt? Green blood. Look, we can see the masts of the ship that'll be taking us. This is one sacred adventure we're embarking on. I hope this island will keep its promises. In order to know that, we'll need to find Constantine first. You're right. Maybe he's already at the port. He was so eager to leave. This will be quite the chore to finish before our departure. The commander wants to recover some merchandise from our supplier. But the Did they spell merchandise wrong with the Z? I, did all I, could to I thought it's an S. Nothing came of it. Parliamenting fatigues me, but this is your domain. I wouldn't say no to a little help. Of All course. right. Where is the supplier? In the lower boroughs, near the port. Right then. We'll put it on our list of visits. Yeah, he got a bit of a. Well, add Kurt to the team. So, endurance. He's good with melee weapons. Okay. Coin guard, so we pay him. Suspicious. Suspicious relationship. Okay. He's on the team. Where would you like to begin? I've been asked to pay visits to the ambassadors of Teleme and the Bridge Alliance before our departure. Their dwellings are not far from here. We could go there first. Very well. Alright. You think Constantine will be waiting for us next to the ship? I don't know. But it's certainly worthy of inspection. Speak to worker. I'm sorry, I'm afraid that I won't make for good company. Okay, so I'm just gonna walk away from that. I'm like, oh I'm sorry, you probably don't want to talk to me anyways. And I was like, yep, I don't need to talk to you. And I leave. Just like that. How do I get over there? Oh. I've discovered Prince's place. What's going on? Greetings, Your Excellency. Mass funeral, that's not a great start to this game. Alright. This is the ambassador. One of the ambassadors. Lord de Sade. I have been told that you were named Legate. Congratulations. Those are great responsibilities for Legate. someone as young as yourself. It's a Legate. But you will bring honor upon your family and the congregation. Of that, I'm certain. I thank you, well, thank Excellency. You. 
I've come here to inform you of our departure for Tierfredi. My cousin Constantine is about to take up office as governor of New Serene, and I'm accompanying him. I had no idea you would be New Serene. What a shame. I had thought. Well, then, that is a pity. Have a pleasant okay. voyage. A brilliant future awaits you. They say that it is a marvelous island. Please convey to your cousin my congratulations and sincere wishes for success. You seem slightly hesitant. Please tell me what troubles you. Mm -hmm. A rather unscrupulous individual has been sowing trouble in Serene. A charlatan. Oh, a side quest. Alchemist. Do people actually give credence to these lies? Alas, yes. They snatch up his celebrated panacea. Remedies worse than the ill, believe me. As you oh. can well imagine, alchemists are our pride. This vulgar trickster casts dirt upon their reputation and our own at the same time. Yeah, In he's gonna want us to deal with him. Alliance, we would have arrested him. But here, we respect your laws. I shall see what I can do, but make no promises. My departure is imminent. I thank you, Excellency. And I am pleased to see you have taken so well to your new functions of diplomacy. The man mm. operates in the city center. He is said to be clever and mean. Be careful. Be careful. Ask about... What is this bridge alliance? So kind as to tell All right. Enough about that. I need to be going. Goodbye, Excellency. Goodbye, Lord Desade. All right. Did I talk to any of you people? I can't go up the stairs, which kind of makes sense. Your Excellency, Lord Desade. Oh, I see. I can ask the same questions. Goodbye, Lord Desade. That just means I can speak with him, not that there's something new. All right. So there's this ambassador. All right. I'll head over this way. All right. So this is probably going to give me a second quest, isn't it? Good day, Excellency. Sir Desade, to what do I owe the pleasure? Wait, am I, I sitting now? You that my cousin Constantine and I <laughs> Teleported to the chair. The ah, yes. I did indeed hear talk that you had both received callings of greater stature. Allow me to congratulate you. Were Cardinal you Antonius. The congregation? He's a churchman. I thank you. It is a station of great honor that I am sure you will fill with brio and panache. Rio? The mother cardinal Cornelia will be enchanted Odd expression. to expression. you, and your cousin in the future. I only regret that your departure is so sudden. Yeah, he's really? too annoyed that I'm leaving so quickly. To be honest with you, I was hoping to solicit your help in a rather yeah, delicate... Yeah, there's the side quest. Tell me more about it, and perhaps I can take care of your problem before my departure. Very well. A small group of dangerous heretics has found refuge in Serene. We know that your uncle tolerates the presence of all pagans within the city walls. But these particular non-believers threaten the fragile harmony of this place. We would consider it a tremendous favor if you would arrest them and deliver them to our guard. Heresy is not a crime in Serene. You do know that. But I'm sure my uncle would hear your arguments. Why call on my intervention? The prince would indeed give us his blessing, but it would take time. Far too much time. So the prince rules? For according to our sources, Maybe he just the rules the city. have already made contact with a smuggler to take them who knows where. I see. You're hoping that I'll be able to do something before they make it to an enemy city. If your heretics are planning on boarding a ship, then they must be in the dockyards. I'll look into this and see what I can do. Why is he so annoyed about it? How do they feel about the bridge? It's like bridge. science and religion, right? Yeah. 
All right. Well, I must be going. I think that's it for this you. guy. May the light guide you, Dasade. And we'll do the side quest now, hopefully. Right? How do I? All right, so to negotiate with the vendor, Charlton, and the smuggler. How do I know where these things are? Oh, I see. I have one at a time. That's marked. All right, so let's go and negotiate with the vendor next. So that's just up here. I believe I've seen you at the palace. Are you one of the prince's relatives? You could say that. All right. Hello, vendor man. Good day, good sir. How might I be of service? Is everybody in this city kind of sick? To one of the orders agreed upon with the guard. There's been a misunderstanding, sir. Of course, we're ready to honor the orders. In fact, I've already had a word with your master at arms. They're asking that we pay again, despite having already paid. It's just that the price has gone up since. I've nothing to do with it. This is inadmissible. If you agree on a sum, you need to honor that agreement. I'm sorry, sir. I'm just an agent, and I'm only obeying orders. Your master has apparently asked you to demand a second payment for this merchandise. That's right. He told me that their attendant seemed to be hiding something when he passed the order. And so he must have thought the guard would end up paying in the end whatever he asked for. I'll be damned. And I'm the one they've sent to settle the affair. Sorry, Captain. It's nothing personal. I'm only following orders. Following orders. Yeah, yeah we hear you. Makes one wonder which one of the two of us is a coin guard. Okay. Why don't we go and solicit other suppliers, Kurt? When we've already paid for the merchandise? If these thieves agree to reimburse yeah. the original payment, it's what we do immediately. And do know, in the future, we won't be shopping with them. Well, I should think not. <laughs> this whole story sounds suspicious and stinks of a scam. They've attempted to uh, extort us for additional payments. Maybe we should not work with them? I'm not demanding nor refusing. It's my master. This stubborn fool is pushing me to madness. You understand now why I'm asking for your help? Interesting, interesting. So I can threaten a prison sentence. I can bribe him, which seems kind of silly since uh, that's the whole point. Is he's asking for more money? Let's threaten a prison sentence. I don't think you understand who you're dealing with. Perhaps I failed to present myself properly. Lord de Sade, nephew of the Prince d'Orsay and legate of the Congregation of Merchants. During our conversation, you explained to me that your master forced you to commit a crime. Uh. That's regrettable. Especially as you will be considered his accomplice in extortion, theft. You know as well as I that the congregation does not tolerate such illegal activities. Dun, dun, dun. Obeying orders. That is a shame. Well, as orders are the only language you seem to understand, I order you to return the guard the merchandise without delay, unless you'd rather your master is hung and that you finish your days in prison. Ooh, okay. As you that was quite the threat. I shall go immediately and ask that these crates be delivered to the attendant. Now that's a wise decision. Thank you. I was beginning to think this would never end. You're certainly honoring your new title. All right. Bravo. The quartermaster must be expecting us. Uh, okay, yeah, that's it. To my help. And yeah, to the yeah. Yeah. Okay, hold on. How do I... How am I supposed to block that? Alright, there's that one. Oh, I have my... Yuri. All right, there's two. And there we go. All right, that was kind of random. Can I loot? Oh, I can. Uh, there we go. 
I can speak to Kurt. Do you need something? Uh, I'm, no. sleepy. I'm not just gonna ask him if he feels lonely. That's kind of weird to just suddenly ask him. Uh, I can loot this guy. Got some gold coins and ammo. Uh, I don't see the third. Strength my health up. And we're all good. Alright. A little stuck there. Uh, oh. Uh, all right. Well, I'll check out the tavern since I entered. Good day, tavern keeper. Good day to you. What is your pleasure? What do you want? Hey. Eh? How is business going these days? It's picking up. We've not seen many new customers, but of late things are looking better. The Malachor and the neighboring wars have dampened commerce. The epidemic still rages, but the possibility of finding a cure on that island has given people something to hope for. Now that we have a city there, quite mm. a few seafarers come by to spend their wages. So, wait, we're in the middle of an epidemic, and I need to people are still coming in to buy our stuff? You know, since we're in the middle of a real pandemic, it seems a little uh, not correct. Ooh, crafting. Okay. I don't think I have very much I can do right now. Cool. Alright, good to know that it exists. There's a. Oh, is this the. No, this is a different merchant. Oh, here we go. Here's where we're going. Uh, he's over here. The quartermaster. Sounds like someone you'd find on a pirate ship. You set sail soon. Have you seen to our little business? Yes. We were finally able to recover your merchandise. Excellent news. I'm afraid, though, that your mission isn't completely finished, Kurt. Blast me. I'm a captain, not an errand boy. The commander <laughs> was quite explicit. Very well. What do I need to do? The merchandise that you obtained needs to be sent to Tier for D as soon as possible. But the Port Authority formalities for shipping take an eternity to wade through. And we've already lost quite a bit of time with this dishonest merchant. Are you blatantly asking us to smuggle this merchandise and contraband? I would never ask you to do such a thing, Your Excellency. Ah, but you don't mind <laughs> asking that of Kurt. Well, now, yeah. If he finds an alternative solution that is less uh, illegal, uh, that would be fine. You're still discussing a crime right in front of me. This cargo must reach the Isle on the next ship. Marvelous. Well then, I await your return with all okay. the patience. I'm certain you shall do what's required. Interesting, interesting. So we don't want to smuggle, but he wants us to get it there one way or another. Those are some big guns. Alright. Let's head back out. Miss the door a little there. Oh, I don't have to use E to do the door. That's good. Oh, here we go. Find the charlatan. Let's do that. He's apparently right over here. Yeah, he wasn't that hard to find. The absolute cure of everything. Mm -hmm. That sounds legit. Stomach ailment. Just solves all the problems. This potion heals all of that. And more still. This Little file is the product of years of research. I think this is kind of the definition of a snake oil salesman. I hear you asking if this remedy is completely selling something that marriage. clearly doesn't work. Alas, I mean, it does everything. But your question is legitimate. I am so close to finding the cure. But the Malachor the cure. isn't the only ailment causing you to suffer. Not true? 
then don't miss out on this chance. So it cures everything except for the thing that's really bothering you. You know, that seems so legit. Definitely not. He just doesn't know how to make it properly. Does it really heal everything, your potion? Everything. Absolutely everything. Except the Malachor, of course. That being said, <laughs> it is known that those in top health Except. resist the Malachor best of all. Then don't throw away this chance. Think of all the pains that this potion could help you avoid. You are right. It's a deal. So this I'm disease is called the Malachor, then. Hurry now! There won't be enough for everyone. There he is. He's our man, no doubt. Yep. His speech is well polished. I even feel like buying some. And if we had a word with him? I wonder if he'll serve us the same routine. I mean, probably. Let's talk to him. Finally tempted. In all honesty, I haven't made up my mind yet. I want to be certain that I'm not dealing with a charlatan. In this day and age, <laughs> I can't blame you. What might I do to convince you? Uh, nasty side effects. How well tested is it? Is it FDA approved? Will you drink one of your potions to prove your good faith? Of course. I take a little sip every morning. But as I am in perfect health, you won't be able to verify the improvement in my condition. But if it helps you make up your mind, give me just a moment. Okay. It just it literally just blacked out only the part where he drank it. Excellent condition. Come on now, I saw you take that vial out of your pocket. Nothing proves that it's the same potion that you sell to your clients. As a man of science, I consider skepticism a remarkable quality. But in your case, it is not skepticism, but blindness. We need uh. to steal one of these potions and force him to drink it. Brilliant idea, Kurt. Let's take a look at his cart. That's a pretty random thing for him not to want to do. And that's quite the escalation. You know? Oh, well, he won't drink it. It's probably poison. Gotta force him to drink it. Can I jump up here? No. Okay. I have to walk around. Or run. Uh. Let's see. Uh. All right. So those obviously aren't his. So it was a true alchemist. The weird alchemist the alliance turns into ruins. So doesn't have to clean anything. Okay. This. Oh, I'm being attacked. Alright, got that one. Let's... Uh... Block... Well, I don't have that much armor. I'm just wearing a traveling killer, I think it was called. Ooh, a war axe. That's exciting. Nicer boots. Alright. Charlatan's antidote. Alright. We got the things. <gasps> yeah, just take everything out of this random chest. I didn't say it was stealing, so I think I'm good. Alright. Let's go and try and unmask this charlatan. This crazy snake oil salesman here. Have you finally made up your mind? <laughs> uh, let's show him the remedy. A vial of your medicine. Would you be willing to drink it in front of us to prove that there is no risk? This bullying is trying my patience. I'm beginning to suspect that you might be working for a rival. You refuse <laughs> to taste it. You might have put something in it to cause me harm or further disgrace. No, look. The vial is still sealed. 
It comes straight from your stock. And you dare challenge me when you have just admitted to being a thief? Come now. You can see for yourself that I'm gladly returning your vial so that you might drink it in front of witnesses. This might help to dissipate my doubts. It's still kind of thievery, but you know. I, you don't have the right. Damnation! He got away. He can't have gone far. Find him before his head ends up on a spike. Think back to the note that we found. We need to take a look at the tavern. He won't leave the city without his belongings. Okay. So I guess it is really bad for you. Not sure how he got away. You know, is he disappear in a cloud of smoke like Batman or something? Uh, I think they said second floor. Oh yeah, there we go. You again? What are you doing in my room? I'm not the only one that has found you. Have you seen the mob that is gathering in the street? I'm neither deaf nor blind. <sighs> By the spheres. Why didn't I leave the city while there was still time? Because you're an idiot. Your ambassador is quite you're crazy. By your commerce, and he is the one who sent me. Sahin. Him again. Ruining my career wasn't enough for him. He's the very reason I had to leave the Alliance. And here I am, playing the part of the potion maker. Me, who was once a respected member of the I don't Academy know, you seem kind of sus. Are you not ashamed to have poisoned those poor souls? These potions are not harmful. That is to say that they don't contain any harmful ingredients. But you could just as easily produce real healing potions. So why don't you? Oh, you don't understand. I fled, but I haven't put a stop to my own research. This potion is an attempt to create in those who drink it a resistance to the Malachor. So you manipulate people to use this experimental... Yeah, thing. that's almost... Well, that's not it's worse, but... <laughs> I don't have a choice. But it does certainly not harm, good. I assure you. If this potion were inoffensive, then why wouldn't you drink it when I offered it to you? I ran tests uh. myself. For such a long time that I ended up becoming intolerant to it. A small <sighs> sip of this mixture provokes in me now a violent reaction. I mean, the mob. Right, but it's not harmful. <laughs> normal dose, I assure you, is without risk. Dr. Sahin warned me that you were an imposter. <laughs> that doesn't surprise me coming from him. I was a master alchemist. I understand if you don't believe So he's trying to trick people just to experiment on them. I would still be one if Sahin hadn't set up a chain of machinations to disgrace. It's just really unethical. Why does Sahin bear you such hatred? I was unfortunate enough to oppose certain great minds of the academy, to criticize their methodology. I saw them inflicting torture on sick prisoners. Making them drink the most vile poisons to find a remedy to the Malachor they won't hesitate to kill. I could not keep my silence. Oh, so they were even worse. It's an act of courage that you fell from grace and earned Sahin's hatred. Your methods don't seem so different than those of your colleagues. I don't torture people. And this potion only has side effects in high doses. Well, that you know of. But you're hurting innocents. I cannot let your commerce continue. So... What are you going to do with me, sir? Uh. No, we're going to arrest sorry, him. But I don't trust you. I'm going to deliver you to Dr. Sahin. Sir, I beg you to spare me. I've heard enough. You're under arrest. How unjust. Uh, we're going to tell him he's under arrest and then just leave. I guess let's go back to the embassy right away. That's kind of nice that I could fast travel like that. I'm not sure that was the best decision, but he was being pretty unethical. I tracked down your man near the coin guard barracks. Finally! Did you capture him? Let's just say I put an end to his activities. His reputation in Serene is forever tarnished. Matters turned out a little more complicated than anticipated. He is hiding in a room in the Coin Guard Tavern. Why didn't you have him arrested? Angry citizens have gathered round the building. 
They have sworn to avenge themselves after discovering his fraud. I decided it better to avoid the mob. But if you wish to capture him alive, I advise you hurry. Governor Burren will be happy to learn that a legate with great assiduity will soon be joining the island of Tirfredi. Thank you for your help, Excellency, and allow me to offer you this modest present for your voyage. I need to be going. Goodbye, Excellency. Goodbye, Lord de Sade. Ooh, I leveled up. Level two. All right. On to the next quest. Uh, I'm not sure what the next quest should be. I guess the smuggler. Where is that? Oh, all three of them are down here. Okay, cool. Let's head down there. All right, so I'm at the port. Who are you? I still don't uh, see Constantine at your side. I hope he has Oh, this is our ship guy that we're taking later. We'll find him in time for departure. I certainly hope so. Oh, would you be in need of my help in any way? Um No, but who is this guy? Or are you just here to keep an eye on us? Come now, don't be ridiculous. I'm coming in the capacity of official advisor. Nothing more. Makes it sound like something more. Also asked me to report to him on certain strategic mm. observations. So yes, he's here to spy on us. To take note of all events, uh, chart the island and its resources, but also obtain as much knowledge as possible concerning the more dangerous creatures of the island. Your help will be extremely valuable. But not spying on you. No longer the Just recording everything. It's always a privilege to help, Master. I need All right. to be leaving. I have quite a few things to do before we raise anchor. Yeah, and I keep getting more. Alright, so this is the smuggler dude. Uh, not sure what that guy was doing, but... I promised the merchants and their prints would be off before the tide. You, man, carry that properly. That porcelain is worth more than your life. <laughs> Some children we'd be best to refuse. Captain Vasco. So kind of a I'm decided mean person. If all is in order, we will soon be embarking on your boat. Oh. Not a boat. Okay. Apologies. Apologies for my asking, but the young governor isn't with you. He didn't come home this morning. Oh, this is the captain. This isn't the smuggler. Okay. To him or he hasn't changed his mind. The tide does not wait. <laughs> Perhaps he simply celebrated his imminent departure with a little too much enthusiasm. Is everything ready? We're short a crew member. The cabin boy is missing. But have no fear. We will leave without him if he does not present himself before the tide. <laughs> is he an important member of the crew? We don't need him for sailing or navigation. He's only a cabin boy. He must have simply had a bit too much to drink in celebrating his departure. Like another I know. I doubt that Jonas was never Well, here's another quest. And it's been two days since last he was seen. No, I fear something oh. bad has happened to him. Might I ask you, if you hear anything, could you report it to me? I would like to set sail with a clear mind. Yeah. That's When did you see your cabin? Let's find out what happened to this cabin boy. Two days since I've had any news at all. It wasn't out of the ordinary until this morning. My men have free shore leave when we're at dock. But the day of departure, every able-bodied sailor must be present on the ship. Okay. Have you seen anyone wandering about? Suspicious looking. Maybe clandestine passengers. See where these heretics are, maybe? There are far too many comings and goings to spot possible stowaways. As long as they don't try and get on my ship, I pay no attention to them. That's set. We did catch ourselves a smuggler just a while ago. A smuggler? Oh. Maybe he could be of some use. How'd you catch the smuggler if you're not paying attention? Not far from the warehouses. Why I ask you, why the sudden interest in smugglers and the odd stowaway? Uh, 
Let's tell them. The heretics are planning on leaving Serene. The ambassador of Teleme has entrusted me with the job of capturing them. Happy to see that you trust me enough to seek my counsel in the affair. Just so happy yeah, I was kind of curious. What would you think? The cardinal's men are far from discreet. They're making quite some ruckus, asking to search our warehouses. We, of course, refused entry. Only the Nords have access. The Nords. I'm sorry, Your Excellency, but I'm certain your potential stowaways aren't far. But we won't allow you to make a search to grab them. Not officially, at least. What do you mean? That discretion lies. It's an odd way of putting it. Okay. I have a favor to ask before we leave. I'm on Liz. We would like to load some merchandise into your ship's hold. Impossible. You're too late for that. All merchandise must be registered at the Port Authority, and the formalities are long. So, unless you're asking me to turn smuggler and hide contraband on my vessel, I wouldn't go that far. We're only talking about a few crates, after all. Go well, smuggler. They'll have to wait. The next ship for New Serene leaves in a month. Hellfire. If that shipment doesn't leave today, the commander will have my hide. Captain, I understand your position, but isn't there some way we can get these crates on board? Some legal I way? Doubt it. Even if I wanted to help you, my quartermaster is a half crazed bridge troll. He's gone into his head that a gang of ruffians want to use my ship to pass contraband. Ah, uh, just two ruffians, just it's me and Kurt. Our cargo is being held before being loaded. All that is not in the warehouse and noted on the manifest will be left on the docks. Sorry, but your crates are gonna have to wait until the next ship sets sail. Mm. Sorry, Kurt. At least we tried. The commander is gonna have my head. I'm sure that's what he wanted in giving me this impossible task. In that case, we're going to have to dock to the manifest ourselves. It must be at the Oh, so now we're forging too. Okay. Well. Be back soon, Captain. We need to have a word with that people smuggler the sailor mentioned. He's a captain, Kurt, like yourself. And in order to interrogate the smuggler, we'll need to find a way into his jail. Okay. Okay, so up there is apparently where the jail is. This zone is a uh, certain place are forbidden. A costume. Costume, we can do a dress up. Okay. I've discovered the Knot Warehouse. So the Knot is the faction. Interesting, interesting. If you wore a Knot uniform and you were able to keep your mark hidden from them, they might let us in. Unless we just offered them a drink. You cannot pass. Only the Knots have access to the prison. Oh, okay. Hmm. All right, well, this is a bit of a conundrum. Uh, but I think I've gone far enough to uh, call this episode here. So I'll be back soon with the next episode. Hope you enjoyed this one. Subscribe to my channel to find out when that next episode is dropped.